programs if uh, actually, that's main computer, computer, it tells motors how to use. PEN-GEMS, which stands for Girls in Engineering, Math, and Science. This is our fourth summer doing it, and it's grown every year. We started out with about 25 girls. This year we have 52 girls from the area. Um, and they come and spend a week here doing different engineering activities. So right now they're building robots. Um, we have another group working uh, in material science. And so the idea is to give them a broad overview of different kinds of engineering, get them excited about math and science um, so that they want to go back to middle school and high school next year and, and continue to take math and science classes. This is big girl work. <laughs> yeah, I built castles, but not robots. Nationally, there are about 20% uh, of engineering majors are women. At Penn, we do better than that. We have about 30% uh, engineering majors, but we're always, always wanting more. And so we think that a lot of it is about girls not realizing what engineering is about, and that seems to disproportionately affect women versus men. And so we really want to introduce it to them early so that they know what kinds of math and science classes they need to be taking in high school in order to apply to an engineering program. Our largest major for undergraduates is bioengineering, and that major has nearly 50% women over the last several years, and that's been pretty consistent for us. Uh, so today we're actually doing a mock forensic study. So we actually have them cover a, a lot of basic molecular biology skills. Uh, so they learn a, a, quite a bit about DNA, both the structure and the chemistry of DNA. Uh, they'll also learn uh, how various enzymes uh, can be used to manipulate DNA, such in, in this case, they'll be using restriction enzymes to cut DNA into fragments.